I think we have more engagement with more clients than ever before. Some of that engagement is on ESG issues. Um, because of the specific gun issue, we did canvass our clients throughout the world about, uh, you know, are they, do they want to have a portfolio composition that, that filters out firearms? Um, and we concluded there are some investors who do. Most investors did not. We have to always remember, this is not BlackRock's money. We're an advisor, too. Our job is to try to help them navigate these complex issues. They're the money owners. And so what we have done after canvassing, we did you know, create these other ETFs that have these type of filters in these small cap products. Um, unquestionably, we are seeing more ESG demand worldwide. And probably the biggest net change is demand in the U.S., um, and so has that helped us? I would say unquestionably being part of a dialogue, trying to help them navigate these complex the issues. But the positive to negative uh, calls, emails, inf customers, uh, how many customers have said to you, you know what, Larry, I, I'm not doing business with you guys. I don't even want, I don't, I don't want you involved in this. I'm taking my money and going elsewhere. And how many people have, how many people have come to you and said, I'm really glad you're doing this, okay. and I actually want to do more business with you as a function of it? I would say it was 90-10, 90-10 in favor of what, of what we are doing. And maybe it's 95-5. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.